Hi, it's me, Zatarum Dost again. Windows 11 version 24H2 is the next feature update. Coming later this year, 2024. Unlike version 23H2, 24H2 is not an enablement package. It will require a complete reinstallation of the operating system. Even since the first release of Windows 11, you might be using workarounds to install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. But what's going to happen? Windows 11 version 24H2 will put an end to very old processors. Very old processors. Very old processors. Since we two five nine zero five. A CPU with the instruction POP CNT is now required. Otherwise, it won't boot. Posted by Bob Pony on X formerly Twitter. POP CNT stands for population count. Luckily, Bob Pony has also made a custom Windows PE which is tuned to check if your PC will boot Windows 11 version 24H2. Link will be in the description. Here I am using VMware Workstations Pro 16. And now click Create a new virtual machine. New virtual machine version. Choose typical. I will choose typical. Click next. Here it will ask uh, you how, how will you install the guest operating system. I will choose. I will install the operating system later. The virtual machine will be create a blank with a blank hard disk. Now choose select a guest operating system. I will choose Windows 10 and later x64 VMware Workstation Pro 16 didn't have an option for Windows 11 Now click next Type the virtual machine name Now I give it the name it the test one and specify the location you can either type here or click browse and choose a location browse <coughs> click next now type the max maximum text size in gigabyte and here we, we will choose store virtual next as a single file. Click next. Ready to create virtual machine. It will be created with the following settings. Settings. Now we will click customize hardware and hardware. For memory, I will cho choose four gig gigabytes. <coughs> processors for the number of cores per processors per processor. I will choose two. 
number of processors to total four. Now click on the news, new CD, DVD, setter. No. And the first view changes to in connection. Now we choose to use ISO image file. The click browser. And now we choose this. This is the one I download from from Bob Pony. And now click open. You can also double click on it. Now click close. In this window, cl click finish. Now click power on this retro machine. Press G. It boots. Here it will open a that's a window showing that Windows 11 version 24H2 works on this PC. It also opens this CPU Z. If your PC boots into this environment, your PC will boot Windows 11 version 24H2. Otherwise, if it's stuck at the Windows logo without a spinner, your PC won't boot Windows 11 version 24H2. If you want to take a picture of this screen, then post it online. This Windows B also have several uh, some other applications automatically start, including command prompt, not bad, not bad. And Task Manager. What I said, what I said, the Windows P pre installation environment from Windows 11 still is the Windows 7 Task Manager. Now we again thank thanks to Bob Pony for this checker. If this video is helpful, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.